Ravi applied for a personal loan at a bank. Unfortunately, the bank rejected his application. The reason for the rejection was stated as a discrepancy in his credit score. Now, a credit score reflects an individual's financial health and credit worthiness. It also shows their attitude towards debt repayment. Credit bureaus like TransUnion Sybil and Experian give credit scores based on an individual's credit history. This score is a three-digit number. Now, Sybil's score ranges from 300 to 900. A recent survey analyzed the credit scores of Indians. Let's discover what the survey reveals and what your ideal credit score should be, shall we? Now, according to a report by uh, OneScore, a credit score monitoring platform, the average credit score of Indians was 715 in FY22. A credit score of 715 is considered fair, but there is significant room for improvement. A study conducted among 90 lakh users across the country revealed that around 63% of participants had credit scores between 300 and 747. Now, generally, a civil score of 750 or above is considered very good. Scores between 625 and 750 are considered fair, while those below 625 are considered low. Banks check an individual's credit score before granting loans or credit cards. It helps banks to assess the risk involved in lending money. A good credit score reduces the risk of losing money. The closer your credit score is to 900, the more confident the bank will be that the loan will be repaid. Coming to the advantage of a good credit score is that you get a loan at a lower interest rate compared to a person with a low credit score. On the other hand, if your credit score is low, banks charge a higher interest rate. What that means is that the loan will become more expensive. Many a times you may be denied a loan or say even asked to provide a collateral. If, like Ravi, you have a bad credit score, you are having trouble getting a loan, you can improve it. It takes a lot of hard work to build a credit score of 750 points. Now, here are some tips that you can follow to achieve this target. First, pay your credit card bills and loan EMIs on time. Make full payment. These are the most effective way to improve your credit score. At the same time, you also become a reliable customer in the eyes of the banks. Avoid making defaults or any delay in payments. This has a negative impact on your credit score. Your credit utilization ratio should not exceed 30% of your credit limit. Now, the credit utilization ratio or the CUR is the ratio of the amount you spend using your credit limit to your actual credit limit. For example, if your total credit card limit is 2 lakh rupees, your spending should not exceed 30% of it or 60,000 rupees. You can set the credit card spend limit or spending limit via the net or phone banking options. It will also help you avoid overspending as well. And also, don't just keep your credit card as a showpiece in your wallet. Use it. Spending on your credit card and paying it off on time improves your credit score. You also get rewards and discounts as well. Do not deactivate your credit card unless necessary. The longer tenure of your credit card, the better is for your credit score. This shows that you have used and paid for credit without any problems for many years. Whenever you apply for a loan, the bank checks your credit report. This is considered a hard inquiry. Making multiple loan applications in a short time period can create many hard inquiries. This can hurt your credit score. Keep checking your credit report every two to three months. This will help you identify any errors in your credit report. Errors in your credit report can damage your credit score. Your credit score and all loans are linked to your PAN. For example, if someone fraudulently uses your PAN for a loan, then that loan will be on your head. If you default on the loan, your credit score will be bad. It is important to catch errors in your credit report and get those corrected with the bank and the credit bureau. You can create an account by visiting the website of Credit Bureau Sybil. The address is www.sybil.com. Then you will have to provide your PAN number and other details. After registration, you can check your civil score for free and download your credit report. Avoid settling loans as this can hurt your credit score as well. Try to talk to the bank and gradually pay off the entire loan. If you are unable to pay the full credit card bill in a month, make sure to pay the minimum amount so that it does not affect your credit score. We hope these tips will help you get your credit score above 750.